representing states like New York and all across America, we came together tonight to listen to President Biden say, tell us in his own words what his plans were. I'm here to tell you today, President Joe Biden is in it to win it. And all of us said we pledged our support to him because the stakes could not be higher. On the eve of the 4th of July celebration, we talk about how we transition under a monarchy and a tyranny that our founding fathers fought against, that we risk right now descending back into that very same place. We will stand with the president as we fight that force, that force being Donald Trump. And together, we'll make sure that Americans know not just what Joe Biden did for all of us, and the list of what he did for my state of New York is extraordinarily long, but where he's going for the future and where he's going to take this country. We feel very confident in his abilities we talked about the plan and how he's going to be very focused on issues that matter to Americans, and I felt very confident coming out of this meeting as well. Is he fit did for you, office? Did you Do you think that? he's fit for office? Yes, he's fit for office. The president has. Three and, a half, three and a half years of delivering for us, going through what we've all been through. Uh, none of us are denying. Thursday night was a bad performance. It was a bad uh, it was a bad hit, if you will, on that, but it doesn't impact what I believe he's delivering. Did you what would you say to people in your own party? What would you say to people in your own party who say the game is up and not enough? No, I, I, would, I would say this. In November, we've got a clear choice. The president was very clear that he is in this to win this. And the president is going to, the president is our nominee. The president is our party leader. And the president has told us, and he was very clear back there, that he is in this to win this. And so for people, I would say, and listen, we're governors. We don't do hand wringing. That's not what we do. Governors work and get things done. Governors say, tell me the objective, and we're going to make sure that we accomplish the objective. And so for people who, 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 are, who are concerned, I just want to be very clear on something. And come November, we've got a binary choice. And the binary choice is between someone who has continually delivered for us and our states and the people of our states, and frankly, someone whose vision for the future of this country is downright dangerous. And so I would tell people it is time to mount up and it is time to get serious and understand what's at stake.